Hey everyone, Doug back at you with a Pennsylvania Dutch Word of the Week. I absolutely love this word. Uh, I heard it a lot growing up. It's just one that, oh man, let's just get to it. Your Pennsylvania Dutch Word for this week is nocha. Nocha. Uh, don't say the G. The G-N is, the G's kind of silent, I guess you'd say. Uh, but nocha means to, so if you look it up in a dictionary, it'll, it'll give you a couple different definitions. It'll say to, <laughs> to overly handle something. Um... It'll also give you the definition of to fondle something. And I know that has kind of like this negative connotation in our English today. The way I always think about it is, um, you know, it's you're always touching at something or kind of like picking at something. Bishtam noja, as we'd say in Pennsylvania Dutch. And that's why the sentence I chose kind of shows that. Es kind was I grind am noja. Es kind was I grind am noja. The child was uh, touching or picking at his scar. Or his scab, excuse me, scab, not scar. A grin is a scab. So, you know, you think about it, and I mean, people do it too. You got that scab and you're always kind of like touching at it or picking at it, or you got something on your skin, you're always, you know, picking at it. Um, that's nocha. Well, how I often heard it used a lot when we would play uh, cards, if the person just kept shuffling and shuffling and shuffling before they dealt, someone would always say, For must be so Why are you, why are you, you know, fondling those cards so much? Deal them out, you know, essentially. It's a great great word. I don't even, it's just, I don't know what we have in English. You know, we do have those words, those definitions, but Nocha has this stronger, mm, it's just a, mm, it's such a great word. Use it. Use it, dear friends. Till next time, keep practicing your Pennsylvania Dutch and mock scoot.